Hey everybody, it's Mrs. Abrams again, coming at you from the Pete the Cat Room, formerly known as the Kinder Dining Pod. It's now the Pete the Cat Room, but it's the same room. So today I'm going to read you a story. It's about Anansi the Spider. I think we've read one story about Anansi, and if you remember right, he's a trickster. And he tries to trick other animals, but he, and then they always, somehow or another, they get back at him, but he never learns his lesson, and he always tries it again. This story is by Gerald McDermott. Now, he didn't invent the story. He didn't make it up. The, the story was made up by, um, was passed down from generation to generation by members of the Ashanti tribe. And um, he just got the story and decided to put it into a book. So, Anansi, he is spider to the Ashanti tribe people. In Ashanti's land, people love this story of Kwaku Anansi. Time was Anansi had six sons. There he is. Look at the beautiful illustrations. First son was called Sea Trouble. He had the gift of seeing trouble a long way off. Second son was Road Builder. Thirsty son was River Drinker. Next son was Game Skinner. Another son was Stone Thrower. And last of his sons was Cushion. He was very soft. All were good sons of the Nazi. Let's count them. Ready? Count his name. One, two, three, four, five, six. And Nazi had six sons. One time, a Nazi went a long way from home, far from home, and he got lost. He fell into trouble. Oh, take a look at the illustration and see if you can see what's happening. And now on this page, no words, but you can tell what happened. There's a fish and there's a Nazi. And the Nazi is in the fish's mouth. Oh my. Back home was Sun Sea Trouble. Father is in danger, he cried. He knew it quickly, and he told those other sons. Road builder son said, follow me. Off he went, making a road. They went fast, those six brothers, gone to help Anansi. And where is father? Where could he be? Uh -oh, can you tell? Oh, my. The fish stadium. So, River Drinker took a big drink. No more river. Then Game Skinner helped Father Nazi. He split open fish. Oh, there's his head poking out. More trouble came right then. It was Falcon, and Falcon took an Nazi up to the sky. Quick now, stone thrower! The stone hit Falcon. A Nazi fell through the sky. Now Cushion ran to help Father. Very soft, a Nazi came down. Hmm. One, two, three, four, five, six, and Mrs. Character. Everybody say it. Ready? Go. They were very happy, that spider family. All home again that night, Kwaku and Nazi found a thing in the forest. What is this? A great globe of light? Oh, mysterious and beautiful. I shall give this to my son, said Anansi, to the son who rescued me. But which son of those six, which son deserves the prize? Who would you give it to? Hmm.
Naomi, can you help me? Oh, Naomi, called the Nazi. For Ashanti people, Naomi is the god of all things. The Nazi asked this of Naomi. Please hold the beautiful globe of light until I know which son should have it for his own. Did you figure out who you'd give it to yet? And so they tried to decide which son deserved the prize. They tried, but they could not decide. They argued all night. Naomi saw this. The God of all things, he took the beautiful white light up into the sky. He keeps it there for all to see. It is still there. It will always be there. It is there tonight. What do you think that white light is? Do you have any ideas? Hmm. So this story about Anansi um, doesn't tell how he tricked anybody, but you know, something had to get him in trouble in the first place because um, he's not always safe and he does get in trouble a lot. So have you figured out what the white light is? Do you think it's the sun? Do you think it's another planet? Do you think it's the moon? So I would love for you to draw a picture of what you think that white light is and label it. When you label it, you write what it is and draw an arrow to it so we know what you're talking about or what it is and that you know what it is and that we know what it is. So I love Anansi stories, and maybe I'll be able to get my other Anansi stories out of the classroom, you know, one of these days. Otherwise, um, maybe I'll just tell you an Anansi story. Never know. So have fun reading. Read, 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 read. And, um, um, um. I found my poster, but then I moved it to another pile. So just remember this, guys. I love you, and I miss you, and have fun learning. See you. Bye-bye.